I've always been supported at Burkitt's to do whatever I wanted to do to grow the business or develop my area. And I've always been given what I need to do that. And I think with those two things, you know, the encouragement and confidence and the tools of your trade, then you can't help but flourish. And I think that's one of the big things that Burkitt's has given to me. I've only felt incredibly supported here in, in my own ambitions and progression going forward. We have our learning and development team and they do a fantastic job in putting on training, you know, in any elements that people need really, whether that's technical skill or some of those more soft skills that people might need kind of on their career journey. We have our legal talent management framework and that's a document that really maps out a person's career. It will take you through kind of the journey from when you qualify as a solicitor through to associate, senior associate, legal director, and then partner. I came into Burkitt's very much with the attitude of, I'm a sponge, you know, I'm gonna learn from all these incredible people around me. And fortunately for me, they, they reciprocated by teaching me. That's what they like here. So in terms of my professional development, I came in as a solicitor and um, it was a year later that I became eligible to apply for associateship. So I took up that opportunity. In terms of the senior associateship, I did find there was a kind of a marked difference um, in that there were partners who would approach me and say, you know, I hope you're applying this year and oh, how, whereabouts are you? Are you six years qualified yet? And that's, you know, hugely encouraging. The Emerging Leaders programme is a program that highlights individuals that are progressing to you know a relatively senior level and it's just about taking them to that next level and giving them everything that they need in order to yeah progress in their careers and be able to you know be successful people leaders it's not something that's just open to legal professionals one of the biggest things that people forget about professional services, but I think legal services in particular, is as you move into a management or a leadership role, it's actually quite a big step for somebody that's been an academic and then moved into being private practice. You're suddenly, you know, you've got an HR role, you've got a marketing role, you've got a BD role. It's a really unusual role. So I think the firm supports people really well to make sure they've got all the skills they need to be able to do all those different aspects. I love the idea of people taking the initiative. I also think it's very empowering for people to feel that they've got the latitude to be able to have that room for initiative um, and I just encourage people to take advantage of that every day. I like the opportunities that come up to improve myself and where I am in my, my job and the opportunity to try things that I wouldn't have done with guidance but also freedom. The culture and the environment from the partners is one of empowering people in the team where you've got interest and enthusiasm to get involved, then absolutely you're able to do that and sort of you no know, heavy micromanagement. That's not just in my team, I see it, you know, across all the departments really. A key thing that I have experienced is the internal pushing to be the best version of yourself. I probably would not have applied for associate as early as I did, but I got that push from my line manager telling me that you know, she thought it was definitely the right time and that gave me the confidence to go for it. We really want to see people kind of succeed and develop their careers.